Hey, what's up? This is Lawrence and welcome to Sleepy Squid. In today's video, we're going to be covering how to create a catch-all email for sneaker botting. So first thing we want to do is go to this site called Namecheap.com. Um, if you don't have an account already, you can sign up. I, since I already have one, I'm just going to sign in. And then once we sign in, we will find a cheap domain name that we can purchase. Okay, so once you sign in, you should be greeted with this dashboard where you can actually search for domain names. So I'm going to search for one called Sleepy Squid Catch, and it can be whatever you want. Um, essentially, we're just trying to find a really cheap domain name that we can use. So I'm going to search for this. Um, and once it's done searching, you'll see it presents me with a couple of options. So the .com domain names are what we're mostly familiar with, and those um, tend to be the more expensive ones. But since we don't really care about the domain name, we just want it, you know, just to create these emails. We want to look for a cheap one. So this one right here, this sleepy squid catch.xyz, and this one is only one dollar a year. So that's a good deal. So we're gonna add that to cart. And then we're gonna go through the purchasing process of this. And then once we actually purchase the domain name, I will go through the settings. So here, um, all you need to know is the domain name is a dollar a year and you can keep this enabled this who is guard this will just pr protect your your information so that way you don't get people spamming you and then once you purchase this I'll show you the, the rest of the steps okay so once you have completed the process of actually purchasing the domain name you should see it listed out when you go to dashboard so remember we purchased sleepy squid catch .xyz. so what we want to do is actually manage the, this domain name settings so you should see it somewhere here on this page, but here, if you click on this drop down, you should see manage. If I click on manage, then what I want to do is scroll down until I see redirect email. And what I want to do here now is actually add a catch all. So when I click on add catch all, it'll ask me, you know, where do where should all these emails be forwarded to? So here's where you'd actually put in your actual email. So I'm just going to say example at gmail.com. But you could think of it this as being like your own. So let's say rob at gmail.com. So essentially all of the emails that get sent to this domain name will be forwarded to this rob at gmail.com. So what that means is, let me just show you this illustration right here. So, so now that you've created that catch-all, you can create these random emails. So you see I say I created test one at sleepy squid catch.xyz. This will get forwarded to rob at gmail.com. And this one, test two, will also get forwarded to the same email. I could say lawrence at sleepy squid catch .gmail.com or, or xyz. It doesn't really matter. All of those get forwarded to the same email. So this is very useful because now we can create all of these unique emails that get forwarded to the same email. So when you're creating your billing profiles in your bots, you can have a ton of different emails, but they're all being forwarded to just one email. So this is very useful because now you won't have to worry about your billing profiles using the same email. You can just provide them all with unique emails. Well, I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to smash that like button. Leave me a comment down below if you had any confusions or you need any help. And also, if you you know wouldn't mind doing so please subscribe to my channel it really does help me and i will see you guys in the next one